It reminds me of those sort of plastic flyways you used to have when you were a kid. You know, you got for like 50p, you know, down at this sort of summer fair or something. And the sort of surface of the ball is sort of, it's, it's very smooth. I mean, it's almost a perfect sphere. And what this means is, is when, you, when your foot comes into contact with the ball, it's very difficult to get any grip on it. So it means you can't spin the ball. So sort of a talented footballer, like not like these guys over here, but a talented footballer, you know, when he strikes the ball, he tries to put some spin on it so he can get top spin so the ball will dip and move in the air. With this ball, it's very difficult to have any of that level of control. Basically, what you'd like to do with the ball is give it a bit of spin, give it a bit of angular momentum. But with this ball, when you strike it, you can't get that spin. And all you do is you give it what's called linear momentum. It just moves in a sort of forward direction without spinning. They never miss the Germans. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I guess they must have done some, some simulations, but did they do simulations with real people? Because at the end of the day, this ball's got to be used by real footballers. And then, you know, they have the final say. And we've seen at this World Cup that clearly something's not right. <laughs> 